The summer is the perfect time to catch a baseball game. For many of us here in central Georgia, Turner Field is a popular weekend destination, but one make a night is going beyond just seeing the Braves and has been for over 15 years. Inside Knight Hall on the Mercer campus, you'll find Richard Wilson. I chair the Christianity department and I teach all of our theology classes. Among the stacks of books and notes are small pieces of another passion, baseball. The 100th year anniversary of minor league baseball, they did these special dolls. It started when Wilson was a teenager and was captivated by the great Willie Mays. That love for America's pastime grew at a historic ballpark here in Macon. Luther Williams Field. When I had season tickets for the Macon Braves, I always sat in this section, seat number 10, <clears throat> so I could see straight down the third base line. Uh, I think there's nothing quite as exciting as a play at home, and I always wanted to be able to see exactly uh, what I hoped the umpire was seeing. It was in that seat with a former student that the idea for what is known as the trip came to life in 1996. We planned the trip and it was going to be a one time thing. We drove to Baltimore and round our way around, ended up in uh, Toronto and then came down to Detroit. They saw as many minor and major league games as they could. 15 years and over 120 ballparks later, the trip continues every summer. Our longest trip was 4,500 miles in two weeks. We went as far north as Green Bay, Wisconsin. Those thousands of miles and hundreds of ballparks have left Wilson with some amazing souvenirs. This is a scorecard that I made and scored on the 18th of May in 2004 when Randy Johnson pitched a perfect game against the Atlanta Braves. This is my ticket stub from the 1995 World Series, Game 6. This is the picture of Sid Bream uh, scoring the winning run in the NLCS playoff games against the Pittsburgh Pirates. Wilson doesn't set out on a trip empty-handed. He has a scorecard ready for every game they'll see along the way. It's turned some heads, too. It always creates a little bit of interest, particularly in the minor league ballparks. Uh, because they say, oh, you must be scouts. Uh, well, we're not scouts, uh, but we have these fancy scorebooks, and so people come and they ask us baseball questions and want to know who the good pitchers are on the team, and we just take it in stride. After watching thousands of innings of baseball, Wilson fell in love with a park that used to stand in the Motor City. Oh, my favorite ballpark of all time is uh, Tiger Stadium that they tore down in Detroit. Uh, we, we saw it on our first trip in 1997, and then 97, 98, 99, we were back to Tiger. The trip will continue on August 2nd and take them through Alabama, Tennessee, Illinois, Missouri, and Nebraska. Wilson hasn't just limited himself to games in the States. In 2000, he was in Japan and worked in 10 baseball games during his trip.